This is the Zach Asbury Show. You're familiar with um, Charles Graham's work. Yeah. That actually yeah. conducted the long-term loyalty studies. He actually found, you know, almost, you know, that's a, typically 45% of people just buy you once in five years in many categories. So, you know, there's just, just actually just huge amounts of people that buy you even more infrequently than once or twice a year. And, of course, all those brand building efforts will then over time obviously produce uh, you know, more more results because, you know, you're just reminding large groups of people that you're there, but it's just going to take forever or long before people actually start picking you up because, you know, all, the, all those activation efforts are just, just, are just not going to be as relevant to those people that won't even notice them, et cetera. So, so if you just think about NBD and, and then just look at that chart, like, yeah, of course, it's, yeah, that's, that's what you'd expect, wouldn't you? But so I don't know, I'm not saying Les Burnett and Peterfield don't know about in, NBD because I, I'm pretty sure they do, but uh, it's, it's, it's more um, what I'm trying to say is that if you just think about and look at the world through that lens, uh, just, just so many things that we encounter or we see that are just very much, you know, it's very uh, uh, logical, I would say, or just can, can very much be explained and predicted by that very simple fundamental principle. I, I'm actually getting to a sort of point where, you know, uh, that's sort of my, the main thing I usually use in, in, in all of my thinking. And uh, before I start thinking about other reasons or, or trying to find other uh, yeah, try to try to find other explanations. Uh, and to be honest, quite often, uh, yeah, much of what you see can be really predicted by that principle. And the two patterns that flow from it. Uh, I think you're referring to double jeopardy and duplication of purchase. Uh, yeah, exactly. One of the two other patterns, but those those are two obviously just patterns that flow from that. Uh, uh, well, NBD and but uh, um, it's yeah. It's it's isn't it interesting how you know, marketing is complex and buying behavior is complex, uh, especially on an individual level. But you know, as marketers, we try to complicate it, uh, uh, maybe unnecessarily, or we do complicate it unnecessarily uh, very often. Uh, and it's uh, there's a very there's, there are a few very simple but powerful principles, and uh, uh, oddly enough, we don't really stick to them. Um, because uh, maybe we, we need to be reminded of, of, of those principles uh, more often and or continuously. Uh, I sort of sometimes see my own work as being like a stewardess or a steward in a plane uh, where, you know, you just need to keep reminding people that this is the way, you know, the seatbelt unbuckles. <laughs> and, you know, yeah, this is how you put the thing over your head because if you're in trouble, you know, this is what you need to do. You need, this is how you blow a little bit of extra air on the thing so you keep floating. And, it's, and you can argue, you can say, well, you know, doesn't everybody know this already? But, I, you, know, I, you know, I don't know. If it's important, it's probably worthwhile repeating. So, uh, I don't know. That's, that's how I... Um, I sometimes see uh, or why I'm, I'm sort of trying to um, be okay with the idea of uh, sharing ideas that are six decades old, but, you know, it's probably uh, worthwhile because it's important to remind people because there's, I think most people in advertising are not over 30. Uh, so, yeah, yeah uh, they've exactly. probably never heard of, heard of those things. Not being t- you know, There's just few universities that really, I think, really – uh, cover this stuff uh, uh, thoroughly enough. You know, I'm pretty sure the yeah, Basel students all over that stuff, and uh, but uh, uh, I'm not really sure how many other universities or places in the world uh, this stuff is being taught um, as deeply and thoroughly as it probably should. So, 